a gelding named Magic, is showing lameness under the saddle. I noticed about two weeks ago that when I was riding him, he would just kind of give out his back end. Like on one side, his leg would just kind of drop. I called out Dr. Brenda so that I could know exactly what was going on so that I didn't continue to ride him and make whatever was going on worse. Good boy. All right, why don't you come on this side? Dr. Brenda tests for weakness. Magic has been giving her some problems when she's riding, and we're trying to figure out if he's got an illness. Easy, babe. Or possibly neurological symptoms where they can't walk, they sometimes fall over. Instability could indicate EPM. You're all right. Hey, 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 hey. EPM is equine protozole myelitis. It's a protozole infection from a parasite that's not normally in the horse. Easy, babe. They tend to destroy some of the spinal tissue, and there tends to be weakness in the hind end, sometimes falling over in the hind end, things like that. It's probably one of my biggest fears with horses. Good boy, you're all right. You're all right. Turn around the circle that way. He does a really sharp turn to the right, which he does fine. Okay. There's no wobble, there's no nothing. Okay, now swap sides, come to this side. I'm gonna go to the other side, good boy. He's not weak in the hind end when we pull his tail to see uh, some of the EPM horses will fall over if you pull on them. Good boy. Magic's holding his weight fine. Okay, I don't really think he's an EPM horse. He's too sound. Typically those horses have some kind of damage in their spinal column or potentially in their brain from the abnormal migrations of the parasites so that they're neurologically not right. I do not get that in this particular animal. I didn't either. <laughs> I think it's behavior more than anything. He seems to only do this when she's riding or trying to ride him. So he's like, I don't really want to carry you around. So if I act weird, you get off. I get to go back to pasture and do my own horse things and don't have to work. And that's pretty fun. So it may be something that you need a trainer to kind of train him through that. As he found out that if he acts wonky, yeah. you get off him, which might be tougher to treat. Right. <laughs> I'm feeling great knowing that it's not EPM. I'll just let him know that I'm not going to take it. I'm glad he's just stubborn and he just has a personality of his own. He's a bit of a prima donna. Some of us are. <laughs> All right, you guys have a good day. 